The program panel is used to view and play the edited videos. As well as when we do the color grading, adding effects, transitions, titles, we have to use this panel to check the final output of the video. Let's jump to next panel, this is the timeline panel. The timeline panel is where your video takes shape. By dragging items from the project panel or source monitor and placing them in the desired order, you create a sequence of clips and events which play in the timeline from left to right. The project panel is where you store all the elements needed to create your finished video. It can contain individual video clips, audio clips, titles, photos and graphical images. We can see sub-panels like media browser, libraries, info, effects, markers and history. This is the toolbar of the Premiere Pro CC, we can cut drag and do many editing works using the toolbar. The source monitor plays back individual clips. In the source monitor, you prepare clips that you want to add to a sequence. You set in points and out points, manage effect controls, lumetri scopes and audio clips. The color workspace in Premiere Pro is a good starting point for color grading in Premiere. It reveals the lumetri color panel to the right, and can show the lumetri scopes panel to the left of the program monitor as well as we can customize the workspaces according to our needs like this. Do you have questions? Become a member of Olaker YouTube channel and comment your questions below. Subscribe Olaker YouTube channel and click the bell icon to become a member.